I'm gonna go out on a limb here and say that you, yes, you watching this right now, are an introvert. How do I know this? Because you're watching YouTube videos instead of being outside. What are you doing on computer? Go outside, so beautiful! Yeah! Don't worry, I'm an introvert too. I got an email from an eight-year-old once. He said he liked my videos. It was one of the worst emails I ever got. So I'm just gonna briefly explain what introvert means to all the eight-year-olds watching this. Hey kids, are you ready to learn? An introvert is a person who doesn't really like to play with other kids. This doesn't make them sad that they're lonely, they just would rather play by themselves. Think of it this way. Has your friend ever asked you to play with them, but you didn't really want to, so you asked your mom to make up a reason for you not to go? If so, then you're probably an introvert, or you just need better friends. Me and my mom had a code word, so if a friend was on the phone who wanted to hang out, I would say, let me ask my mom. And when I asked her, if I said the code word, it meant, mom, make up an excuse so I can't go. I'm not gonna say the code word because I still plan on using it. I actually made a comic kind of similar to this back in 2014, and it's one of my most popular comics, so thanks for liking it. Obviously, it'd be one of my most popular popular comics. I mean, look how great it is. Michael, the creator of Vsauce, hey Vsauce, Michael here, has this new YouTube Red show called Minefield. And as of right now, it's the best YouTube Red series. And in the first episode, Michael goes into an isolation room for three days. He has no technology. He's all by himself for three days. When I first saw this, I thought, hey, maybe I should try that. Yeah, three days of nothing but your own thoughts. I can think of comic ideas, I can write a book, and I don't even have to write any of these ideas down because everything I say is being recorded. This could be my next vacation. Also, speaking of YouTube Red, Hey Susan, I heard you had a new spot open for a Red series. I have this great idea called the YouTuber Swap. It's like Wife Swap, but with YouTubers. Just hit me up if you're interested. Now, don't get the wrong idea that I'm someone who hates people. I don't. It's just, if we're strangers, then I'd rather not talk to you. Unless you're a stranger who's a fan of my videos, okay? We can talk about me all day. Bringing up a point from the last video, don't be afraid to talk to me. You know, every YouTuber is in a weird position with their fans, because if you meet me, you already have a pretty good idea of who I am as a person. Person. For instance, you know how long I wet the bed, but for me, I have no clue how long you wet the bed. So, what are we talking about? I'm okay with having a conversation with people, okay? It's just that I'm never the one who starts the conversation. But again, this doesn't apply to fans. I like to think that I'm decent with conversation, but I don't really know how good I am at it. I did fail public speaking. But on occasion, there are times when-